In this video, I'll show you how to install a full graphics mod for Red Dead Redemption 2. This mod is visual redemption from the developer raised. So far this is the first graphical mod at the moment, it's a mod that has actually been worked on to improve the game. The author of this mod improved the time cycles and made the graphics clean. She looks better than before. This comparison shows how it differs from regular graphics. This graphic adds new shadows that are not available to those players who play on the lowest settings. Therefore, this mod is the best choice for those players who do not have a very productive computer. And now I will show you how to install this mod in Red Dead Redemption 2. To install the Visual Redemption mod, we need to go to the official website of the mod author and download it. Select Red Dead Redemption 2 and download the Visual Redemption mod. You also need to download Script Hook RDR2. And after that, download Lenny Mod Loader. Downloading the latest version. After that, open the Red Dead Redemption 2 game folder and open the Script Hook archive. Open the bin folder and copy the dinput 8.dll file and script hook dll to the Red Dead Redemption 2 game folder. Next, open the Lenny Mod Loader archive. Copy the Mod Manager folder to a convenient location. I copy to the Downloads folder. Next, open the Mod Loader folder and copy these files to the Red Dead Redemption 2 game folder. After that, copy the LML folder to the Red Dead Redemption 2 game folder. Close the archive and open the LML folder. Open the Visual Redemption mod. Open the main folder and copy the Visual Redemption folder to the LML folder, which is located in the Red Dead Redemption 2 game folder. After that, the game folder can be closed. Now you need to go to the Mod Manager folder, which we copy to the Downloads folder. Open the Mod Manager icon through the Administrator. Next, go to the Settings and at the top we should have the path to the Red Dead Redemption 2 game. If it is not there or it is incorrect, then you need to specify the path to the Red Dead Redemption 2 folder where our game is installed. After that click Save. Then click on this icon and click Add. Go to the Red Dead Redemption 2 game folder and go to the LML folder. Select the Visual Redemption mod and click Select Folder. After that, our mod is installed, you can close this program. We start the game Dead Redemption 2. After starting the game, you need to start the story mode. This mod is for story mode only. At the end of the video, I will show you how to deactivate it if you want to play online. After starting the story mode, the mod will work and you will see that the graphics have changed. Now I will use the Rampage Trainer to show you what this mod looks like in different weather conditions. If you want me to show the installation of this trainer, then write in the comments. In different weather, the mod looks very beautiful. It does not affect the performance of the game and is a pleasure to play with. Let's go, boy.
Now I will show you how to remove this mod or deactivate it if you want to play online. To do this, you just need to go to the Red Dead Redemption 2 game folder and select the files that I select. To deactivate the mod, you can delete them or cut them out of the game folder. Move them to another folder on the drive so they are not in the game folder. After that, the game will start without mods. You will be able to play online or story mode without mods. If you like the video then please like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you all for watching.